Okay guys, welcome back to Linda's Pantry and a little different video with the big camera because my phone, oh my gosh. Who hates phone trouble? Please leave a comment in the comment section below. So I started my vlog today, everything was going good. I went to work, I came, well, and then I went to Costco, came back, showed you my Costco haul. I got a fantastic deal. So <clears throat> I'm just gonna recap everything. I'm going to Verizon in the morning because what has happening is whatever I videotape, it freezes up partway through the video and my phone shuts down I try to restart it and it doesn't come back on for a half hour and I can't do anything. And then if I go to look to, to find it in my gallery of photos and videos, nothing's there, even though it was recording. And then even um, shorter, you know, I tried shorter, nothing's getting saved. Even if my phone doesn't shut down, it doesn't save it to the gallery. So. Partly, I think this is my fault because the other day, you know, you're scrolling through Facebook and it said, oh, load this app and you can have this beautiful screensaver. And I thought, oh, well, maybe I will. And it looked harmless enough, but it has changed my whole phone profile. And so I'm hoping that they can just undo all that. And that's the culprit. I've tried to go in and delete everything that I could, but... Uh, it's so frustrating. So tomorrow I get to go spend the morning at Verizon, which I'm okay with. I'm going to go take care of it and then I'll come back and do some canning. I'm just finishing up a canning session that I am videotaping on this camera, but um, I wanted to come in and give you an idea why you're not going to see me if I can't get this fixed right away. If they have to replace my phone, my gosh, then what? You have to, um, you have to wait till they send you a new phone. My phone's insured and it's brand new. <clears throat> but I think it has something to do with the app that got loaded on the phone and it's changed things. So hopefully they can figure it out and fix it. And I've learned my lesson, don't do that. But Costco, okay, I picked up five pounds of organic baby carrots that are peeled and cut and I'm doing a canning session right now I watched and I want to say her name is Tessie the homesteader or Tessie homesteader she did a canning video and what intrigued me about the video was not so much the whole process but the she said she puts um, well she did she put French onions, or not French onion, but Lipton onion soup mix in the jars. And that gave the carrots a different flavor, like they've been slow roasted with a roast. And I was like, oh, now that's intriguing. Because carrots can be kind of um, metallic with a back taste, no matter if it's home canned or store-bought canned. Test me on this and t or try it, because you have to doctor it up with sugar or something else which I don't always want to do that. I, I like savory. Now I do can carrots and celery with dill and you get way less of that flavor. But I was intrigued by it so uh, my canning session this afternoon is carrots with the Lipton on onion soup mix added in the jar. And I only did a small batch canning session with my small 10.5 canner but is there six or seven jars in there? Uh, pint jars. I think there's seven. Maybe maybe it's only six. But three of which have potatoes in there. And I, okay, because there's potatoes, I par cooked first because you have to par cook your potatoes to get some of that starch out. And um, I did that with the carrots. And I also um, timed them for the potato timing because they take longer. So tomorrow we're going to test that out. Um, hopefully I can do it on a vlog, but I don't know when I'll be back to vlogging, regular type vlogging. I'm going to upload this tomorrow. But the big camera, I can't carry it around. <laughs> and I certainly can't hold it out here. <laughs> and I don't have a cameraman. So um, anyway, 
And then tomorrow when I get home from Verizon, we'll be canning up asparagus because I got asparagus $3.49 for 2.25 pound bags. That equates to $1.55 a pound. I've not seen it like that in years. It's gone down to $1.99 a pound, but nothing under that. And I just went, I need to take advantage of this. I love canned asparagus and I love pickled asparagus. So I bought 20 pounds and that's what we're going to do. We're going to can up some asparagus. That will get us through the next year. The spinach that I canned last year, I used um, next to the last jar tonight and it's been about a year. So, you know, you can really rotate your pantry pretty well. Um, you don't have to rush through stuff and we don't use, but if the carrots and potatoes come out, I am going to make quart jars with half potatoes, half carrots, and then they can go in when I want to make stew. Like we're out camping or hunting or it's a terrible day and I don't know what to make for dinner. I grab a jar of carrots and potatoes. I grab a jar of elk or venison or beef that I've already canned. Throw those together, put it over some egg noodles or mashed potatoes. Actually, egg noodles would be delicious. And you got fast feed my way in, in less than 15 minutes. So anyhow, wish me luck on the phone. And I, I can't wait to get back to the regular vlogging. I'm bummed that this isn't working, but it's I think it's my fault. <laughs> User error. I hate apps that are not truthful because that was deceiving and I think that it really, I think it's messed with my phone. So hopefully it's that and it's not my phone needs to be returned and a new one. I have insurance either way, but the, the youngsters at <laughs> Verizon, I call them youngsters because they're all about 20, um, they'll figure it out and um, we'll get everything fixed. So guys, I can't wait to see you next time. I'm going to show you all kinds of good stuff coming up. I've got, I'm canning this or I'm videotaping my canning sessions for you. So we've got plenty to go around, including vlogs. And in fact, I need to edit a video tonight for you. So you have something else to watch tomorrow. All right. I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Hopefully. Bye. Mwah.